My name is Jamana and this is my first video of a series of videos that I've decided to do with, um, on the progression of my journey. Now, I wish I could say that I've been asked to do these videos. I wish I had, you know, this massive following of people that were aching for me to do this video, but that is not the case. I, myself, have obviously recently launched, um, you know, a YouTube channel and I'm really pursuing a passion to build, you know, um, a strong following of my lifestyle show and that, you know, and I'll explain that in perhaps other videos of exactly what it is that I'm doing. But the point of this video and the point of this series is just to share we the making of a success. And it's not so much the emphasis on success, but I think sometimes there's so much out there, there's so much content out there about motivation, how to live your best life, to stay positive. Um, and I think it's so much easier to discuss success when you're there. But I don't see too much content of people who are in the midst of it. They've started their journey. It's almost like they're halfway through their journey, but they're not quite there yet. And they know they're gonna get there, but they're not just sure how, when, but they know why they're doing what they're doing. So I, as I said, my name is Jamana, and I wanna share my story. I wanna share um, where I've been, where I am now, and where it is that I'm going. And in the reason that I wanna do this, firstly, I would like my audience that I do have, and I thought when I started that I'm gonna have this, it's gonna be so easy, um, I'm gonna have this following on YouTube, I'm gonna have all these subscribers, and unfortunately, reality hit me, and it's been five months in, and I'm still only on 65 subscribers, or 67 last time I checked. My Instagram following has only just hit over the three digit numbers. Um, my Facebook page is not even a thousand likes yet. So there's all these things that I think when we put ourselves out there in the terms of the social media domain that we measure our success against. And what I want to do is I just want to lay myself bare and I want to say that this is how it's done. This is the reality of it and that things are not always an instant success and just share perhaps insights into what does success really look like? What is success? Also share my personal story. I think in the sense coming from a background, you know, my parents are, um, my parents came here to Australia, you know, and I was born here. And to be really honest, I've never really felt that I fit in either in the Middle East or here completely. And I just think it's really interesting sometimes that there's things within ourselves that we need to sort of make peace with, I guess, or come to a sense of who are we and what's our identity before we can even really progress on our journey of becoming the best person that we can be. So I will be looking at doing one or two videos a week, talking about just different things. I currently at the moment am and have been for the last three years working on my first feature film, which I wrote and will be directing. And I want to be sharing that progress with you. Now, there's a lot of exciting things that are going on at the moment, but I can't just share them yet because they're a little bit premature. So once they are um, a bit more official and I have things in contract, I would love to be sharing where that is with you. But I also want to just talk about uh, where I'm at with my YouTube and what I'm doing with my business. But it's not even about that. I think sometimes um, we go and we watch videos and I think there's a lot of people that do these sort of vlogs that really do share their passion and what it is that they do. But a lot of these people who are sharing this are people who have a lot of following and a big audience. What I really wanna do is I wanna share my fears. I wanna share the things that worry me um, because I know that there's a lot of you out there who are not quite where you want to be. It's like you've got your eye on a prize, you've got your eyes fixed on a goal, but you're not quite sure how you're going to get there. Maybe for some of us it's been years. I know for me it's been more than a decade. I'm now in my 30s and sometimes I'm, I am can feel like sometimes I'm competing against people who are 10 years younger than me who've already reached you know more goals than I have in, in where I'm at now at this age of my life. But I want to share and I want to be really vulnerable and I want to be um, completely honest and not hide anything because I think for so long, so many of us, and 
you know, especially as soon as we get on the camera. I know for myself, like even now, before I even put on the camera, I went and made sure I put on makeup and made sure that I presented myself in a certain way. But at the same time, as much as we like to construct an image for the world, especially now in the world of social media, I also want to deconstruct that image and take off my mask and say, you know what? It's not always the case and in no way am I pretending to be anywhere near successful in the sense of the way the world or people out there would manage success. But for me, I measure success by the fact that I just show up and I'm willing to put myself out there. And I think half the time I'm really scared. I'm like, freaking hell, what are you doing, Jumana? You know, you're just putting, because once you put yourself out there in the public domain, it's like you're, you're pretty much opening yourself up for all sorts of criticism and people to judge you and misjudge you and say all sorts of things about you. But like I said, I will be doing this video series. I really would love you guys, you know, even if it's just two or three people just to engage with me, let me know what you think, what you'd like to hear more of. Like I said, not everything is the way it seems. A lot of things that pictures that we see these days, they're constructs of reality, they're not reality. And I'm really about dreaming big, reaching for your dreams but at the same time, being honest enough to say, well, this is where I'm at right now and not everything is peaches and cream. So. I hope you enjoy this video. Please look out for them on a weekly um, or maybe bi-weekly basis. And I look forward to sharing more of my story in the next video. I almost forgot, make sure you like, leave a comment and please subscribe. I love you guys. Thank you so much for your support and I'll see you next week. Bye.